Hey everyone! Welcome back to the channel It's Your Girl Your Name, and today we're diving into the latest episode of Found, titled, Missing While Haunted. Now if you've been following this show with me, you know we've had some absolutely intense episodes, and with this one dropping on November 21st on NBC, I can already tell this is going to be another emotional roller coaster. Let's break it all down shall we? This episode really digs deep into the emotional struggle of the characters, particularly Margaret. If you've been following her journey, you know that she's been carrying this massive weight around since Jamie's disappearance, and in this episode she's really trying to push those painful memories down. But of course, emotions can't just be locked away forever, can they? The more she tries to suppress her feelings, the more they push back, and honestly, I'm on the edge of my seat just thinking about how this is going to affect her moving forward. Like what happens when the past catches up with you, especially when it's something as heart-wrenching as losing someone you love. But let's not forget, this isn't just about Margaret. Found always has these multi-layered storylines, and this episode takes us into another case that's going to hit hard, both for the team and for viewers. M.A. is on the hunt for a mother with a mental illness who's gone missing. And honestly, there's so much at play here. Not only is the team working against the clock, but they're also dealing with the complexity of mental health. The situation's even more urgent because this mother's disappearance isn't just about a missing person, it's about someone who might not be able to care for themselves, and the stakes are incredibly high. You can already feel the tension building. It's a situation where every second counts, and with the team's expertise they're doing everything they can to find her, no matter how complicated the case gets. Now let's talk about Zeke. Oh boy, Zeke, Zeke, Zeke. So he's going through a major moment of his own in this episode. We know Zeke's been dealing with agoraphobia, but when an unwanted guest shows up, it triggers something really intense for him. I think this moment is going to be a huge turning point for Zeke, and not just for his personal journey but for his relationship with the rest of the team. The emotional complexity of having a mental health issue and how it intersects with the world around you, especially in a high-stress situation like this, is something Found does so well. And you just know that Zeke's trying to hold it together, but when something as jarring as this guest pops up, it's bound to send him into a tailspin. I'm just really curious to see how he navigates this, because it's not going to be easy for him. Overall, this episode feels like it's going to hit us right in the gut emotionally. We've got Margaret dealing with her unresolved trauma, M.A. facing a race against time to find a mother in crisis, and Zeke struggling with his own fears and limitations. There's a lot of heavy lifting for the characters, and you can already tell this is going to be one of those episodes that makes you feel everything. The tension, the stakes, the heartache, it's all going to be on full display. So if you're like me and you've been loving the emotional depth and the constant twists on Found, you won't want to miss this episode. Missing While Haunted is shaping up to be an absolute game changer, and I can't wait to see how the team handles these personal and professional challenges. Make sure you mark your calendars for November 21st on NBC because this one is going to be a wild ride. That's all I've got for you today, but let me know in the comments how you're feeling about this episode. Are you as excited as I am? What do you think is going to happen next? And as always, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss any breakdowns, reviews, and everything found related. I'll see you next time and until then, keep watching and keep surviving the shows. Peace out. 胜利手势。